hey guys welcome back to my channel this is Sharani today I'm going to show you how to cook long grain white rice in your rice cooker so I'm just using the measuring cup that comes with my rice cooker to measure my rice as always I'm going to have the exact measurements in the description box below I always like to wash my rice before I cook it, but I know some people don't, so this is up to you. If you're interested in a strainer like this to wash your rice, I'm going to leave it linked below so you can check it out. But this just makes it so easy. Instead of using a bowl or a dish and then have to drain the water out and your rice keep falling out, so I just love using something like this. You just want to wash this until your water runs clear. This is so easy. All you have to do now is put the rice in your pot, add some water and a little bit of salt. So usually when you cook rice, it's one cup of rice to two cups of water. But I like to do one cup of rice and one and three quarter cups of water. If you like your rice a little bit softer, you can put the full 2 cups of water or if you want it more on the grainy side, then do 1.5 cups of water. So anywhere between 1.5 to 2 cups of water but nothing more than that because then your rice will be sticky and mushy and you don't want that. Also for every cup of rice, I like to add a half teaspoon of salt. Like I said, I'm going to leave my measurements below so you can check that out and then you can go from there and decide how you like your rice. So if you're not using your rice cooker and you just want to cook some rice on the stove, you can use your finger as a guide to measure how much water to put in the pot. So just put your finger in the pot and your finger should touch the rice, it shouldn't go all the way to the bottom and the water should come up to the first line on your finger and that should be the right amount of water so yes this is the way i was taught to cook rice all you have to do now is cover the pot and put it on your white rice setting and that's it just let the pot do its thing well there you go perfect rice all the time i can't remember the last time i cooked rice on the stove I've had this rice pot forever and it's still going strong and I use it a lot. As always, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you have not yet subscribed, please don't forget to do that and I'll talk to you in my next one. Take care. Bye.